Good morning, everybody. So it's another uh, hectic day for us. Uh, the alarm didn't go off, but thankfully I was a little more uh, ready for it. I uh, just uh, kind of woke up on my own, uh, did not try to sleep in at all. As soon as I my eyes were open, I was starting to look at things. We're definitely going to buy a, an alarm clock, not rely on these phones. They don't want to go off for some reason. Um, I couldn't find the camera, so we didn't get any footage this morning. But it's pretty hectic. I don't know if you really want to see that. You probably did. It was kind of funny. Um, my wife is in there getting her teeth filled right now at the moment. I don't want to be gone too long, especially since we've been in there for a little bit. I'm sure she's getting ready to come out soon. I just want to get some footage before we just suddenly, like, you know, start filming and, oh, she's hurting, maybe can't talk. So, anyway, here we are. Um, nice little, nice little spot to sit. It's kind of, you know, nice. So that's three times out. Um, so, yeah, stay tuned for Shannon hurting. Thank you for joining our family. We're happy you're here. Ever. Like an hour and a half. I actually checked the time and was like, wow, that took longer than I expected. But normally, only everything there only takes like an hour. I was panicking. Oh, you were for a Yeah. Did you go for a walk? Um, no, actually, the only thing I did was uh, I sat over there for like a second. Mm -hmm. uh, did you get any clip from the next? Pretty much. Aww. How are you feeling? I mean, honestly, I'm sure that after the numbing wears off, my tooth will hurt more, but right now, my, um, my mouth hurts more than my tooth because like they had to keep it open with those things. Yeah. On a scale of zero to ten, this is like a fourteen and a half on the difficulty scale because like you picked like the farthest tooth in the back. And the cavity was like mm -hmm. on the side of like the gum. Mm -hmm. So he was like, I know this isn't easy for you, but it's not easy for me. But I mean, um, like for the most part, you're okay, right? Like you're, you're gonna be okay. He put a protective coating on it, so he's hoping that it won't need a root canal. But he said that there's still a chance it might need it. Okay. Just because like cavity is so deep that it's like the nerve is close to being exposed. But he put some protective coating on top of it, mm. so he said that we'll just have to see what happens. Okay. He's gonna let it go for a week and just told me to be very conscientious about like brushing it well and I'm actually wondering if maybe like at the dollar store or at Walgreens sometimes you can get like travel toothbrushes that are like half the size and I'm wondering if that would be easier to like stick back there to brush I don't know if that would make a difference but I was just thinking like how can I do better about getting back there mm -hmm. and they all said like that's the hardest part to brush because yeah. you have like your, your mouth and your jaw and stuff mm -hmm. Anyways, so it was okay. Sometimes, you know, like the numbing stuff doesn't work, but it worked pretty well. So as long as there's no pain, we should be okay, right? For what? No pain, no root canal. Um, that's what he said. He said, he said, the next couple days it'll be, like the next three to four days it'll hurt just because of what, what he did. Mm -hmm. But he said if it hurts after that, then you might need a root canal. Okay. So he said, be honest because like, You'd rather do a root canal thing than extract it. Yeah. Like you'd rather try to save the tooth. But anyway. No, it's between seven and nine hundred. Um, I mean, that's still not good, but I'm just saying the cheapest smaller root canal is two ten. Mm -hmm. I mean, it depends. But isn't that in oh, like? Oh, sorry. Hi, guys. Yeah. Isn't that in multiple installments? I mean, the first visit is that much, and the next visit is also that much. Because like my root canal took three processes. I don't know. <sighs> Let me put in, how much does a root canal cost in Oregon? <laughs> this is boring. Bye, oh. guys. Yeah. <laughs>
Okay, so now for the big question. Can you eat? They didn't say I couldn't. I mean, it might be a little bit... Um... Like, tender, but they didn't tell me not to, so I don't think that it's a matter of not being allowed. Mm -hmm. I'm not gonna, um... Sorry. <laughs> not gonna... <laughs> like intentionally chew on that side and I don't want anything to pop out. Yeah. But he didn't, they, no one said I couldn't. Don't you think that if it was like important for me not to, someone would have told me not to eat? I would hope so. Mm -hmm. But it's hard to say. So do you want to try to eat something? Okay. Okay, so we're going to try to eat something. Uh, we'll catch up with you in a little bit because this is not the last, doesn't it? Uh, like the dentist today. I'll tell you if my tooth falls out. <laughs> she's got to have a cleaning, but she's got to have a cleaning. Why? You're the one that like eats airheads by the bag. Why do you not have cavities? And I actually brush my teeth more than you, and I've got all these problems. I got two fillings. Only two? Do you know many cavities I've had in my lifetime? The day I got my braces removed, I had like 12. I'm just kidding. That's a big number. But like, it's actually very common to like when you get your braces taken off to have cavities because like it's hard to brush under the bracket. Mm -hmm. Anyways. I don't know how he gets so lucky. I'm kind of agitated. I'm pretty sure when my wisdom teeth will end up having one. Mm -hmm. It has a flap. Like a gum flap? That's the worst. Mm -hmm. So it's like, I can't brush it. I, I can't. We'll see. You mm -hmm. should go get an appointment. Like, just get, like, ask them to sign you up for, like, the yearly exam that I had where they do the, they check everything. Oh, uh, you need to. I don't like doctors. Set a good example for your child. I don't like doctors. Set a good example for I your child. I will by forcing them to go. Mexican or Chinese? Racist. Okay, so we've done some more screen cleaning. We still got a long ways to go. At some point, you like, I, I don't want to just like vacuum the drug. I want to like shampoo it. Of course, first you want to vacuum. Mm. I'm looking at you. But anyway, we're getting closer and we're getting better. We're finally starting to put things away, getting them where they need to be. Uh, I mean, the room was clean earlier, but then like I pulled a bunch of crap out. Because like I said earlier, I'm just spring cleaning, you know? Getting a jump start on that. Slowly but surely. Yeah. I find it better to just do like, like a little bit mm -hmm. over a couple days than to try to like, you know, do too big of a project in one day. And mm -hmm. it's just like unmanageable. Yeah. So how are you feeling after you got some Advil in you, J Jasmine? Jasmine, stop photo bombing. <laughs> stop photo bombing, mommy. <laughs> um, a little bit better, but like I'm still very sore. But for some reason, I'm like, I have munchies. I'm hungry. Mm -hmm. I know all you people are about to make fat jokes. Leave me alone. <laughs> stop. We skipped breakfast again. Uh, we didn't really eat that big of a lunch. You're hurting. We, I want to get something fast in you. Because I knew, like, I've, I've been there. It's not fun to be hurting and super hungry. Where he's like, I'm hungry, but I can't eat. Because I hurt. Now I'm sick to my stomach for, like, nine reasons. <sighs> so... I don't know, what do you think? Should we try to make the day a little quicker? Sorry if I'm shaking everybody. Yeah, because you dropped a 25-minute video on them. They've got places to be and things to do. I was just glad I could finally get it up at, like, a reasonable hour. I mean, the last one was, like, super late. I think we launched it at, like, 9. So it was, like, it was, like, on time. But it's a day behind. So we just now finally got, like, our, um editing software back and going how it's supposed to be. So it's like, sorry. I didn't want it to be like a two-parter in like a three video update today. Mm -hmm. It's a process. But I think we've got everything under control again. I'm done apologizing and I'm more about just letting the, my actions speak for myself. Mm -hmm. We're going to be posting on time. You'll see it. I think that we just, we need to like stop assuming that like everything's gonna work I think the best thing to do is just have it edited the night before oh you I mean, ready to go that's, that's what I was actually trying to do okay. is that like um 
I mean, at first, uh, I, I was kind of like editing a lot of our stuff when we had like this huge backlog and we're learning the editing software and like all that stuff. Like we had a huge backlog. We're like, do we really want to do this? Do we really want to do this? And like we start posting. I, I'd uh, try to do in the morning whenever I got up because I usually got up at like four in the morning. So it's like I had five hours to do my work and like edit. But um, it felt like eventually it's going to be better because we kept missing. Uh, it's really not really our fault either to do it beforehand, way beforehand, like before bed. So I was trying to do that, but again, my computer kept crashing. Kept getting the blue screen of death, but it's like a security kernel this time. Uh, but thankfully, this one was a much easier fix than having to like reinstall everything. So thankfully, we're going to start doing it properly, night beforehand. So it's like long ready. So all we gotta do is hit publish. Mm -hmm. Tag and publish. Yeah. We'll see if she can get her button gear and actually tag it properly. No, that is a step too far. My tagging is just fine, but I can't tag when there's no video. So. How long was the video ready and waiting? How long was your video ready and waiting? How long were you getting drilled at the dentist's office? <laughs> I was getting, I wasn't getting drilled, I was drilling, I don't know about you. What are you talking about? <laughs> Thank you for joining the family. We're glad you're here. <laughs> Seriously though, stay tuned. Hopefully, if, you're, if you've been watching us, there's going to be like some changes, and you're going to see it. So, don't listen to me. See, see it. Yawn. Love you guys.